Hi guys, uh, welcome aboard. I am Booger. Yes, I am. We're gonna do some wings as you can see, but we're gonna try them out in the DeLonghi Lavenza air fry convection oven. Um, beautiful. I've already done fries in it, so now we're gonna do my favorite. That's how I tested my first air fryer, the Active Fry by Tefal. It was what? Hooters wings. So I'm gonna use a collapsible batter bowl. Alright, comes with three pieces and it's just absolutely amazing. I'm gonna use, uh, I think I got like six or seven, they're big wings, they're really large. So I'm gonna use enough of this. Uh, you can find this at Walmart, by the way, or Amazon, whatever. This thing right here though, is the first time for me trying it and it is the Three Mile Island Sauce by Hooters. The only place I could see it is uh, on Amazon, so that's where I got it. I'll put a link to that, but I'm anxious to try that. I love the hot sauce, but um, yeah. So you put that on there. The reason why I'm doing this ahead of time, I'm not going to cook these today. I'm going to leave them in the fridge overnight. The longer they sit in this batter, the crispier, thicker is going to be so good. But if you're in a hurry, at least uh, a couple hours. Okay. So I'll show you that tomorrow when we cook the wings in the little oven. All right, guys, let's get that Hooters chicken wings going, hey? All right. So according to the book, <clears throat> here we go. Uh, chicken wings, 18 ounce. Uh, you got to use the tray, of course. So that fits under there easily. Very easy to clean too, by the way. Uh, 450, 15 minutes. I find that hard to believe. I don't know. Maybe they're talking about frozen. I don't know. It doesn't say, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be longer than 15 minutes. Okay. So we're talking, this is the next day, okay? Look how good they look. It's all soaked in the skin and all that. All right. I've got big wings too. I got lucky this day. Sometimes you can't find like some good big wings like this. So very lucky. All right. Ugh, I'm at a weird angle. Ugh, give me a second. I'm on you. Let this roll. You guys are going to see the whole thing. Try not to make them touch. I'm going to fix that there in a minute. All right, let me fix this up. And that bag of batter, Hooters batter, goes a long way, you guys, if you do it this way. All right, that looks good. Scoot on over there, darling. All right. Okay, so when you turn the... Uh, the oven on it uh, has no setting okay so let's put it on air fry where are you at air fry and it's already set at 450 30 minutes I'm gonna leave it at 30 minutes because I'm gonna check it in, in 50 at 15 to see if they're cooked but I doubt it all right so that's flashing you push the set we're gonna leave that and then it goes to the temperature at 450 we're gonna leave it at that and then you just push the start button all right so we'll go from there. Hey guys, we're at the 15, almost 15 minute mark there. And I can tell you that's, that's no way near cooked. So what I'm going to do at this point is, I think they're talking about uh, frozen cooked wings. I'm going to, you see how there's dry flower spots there? I'm going to spray the tops of this with this light olive oil spray. It's got uh, three little, well, not this one. Three little spots there. Anyways, it's a light spray and it's perfect for top spray. Just spray the wings. Yeah, see there's blood coming out of there and stuff. So they're talking about frozen cooked wings for 15 minutes. Okay, so I'm going to let it run for the other 15 minutes and I'm going to check the temperature of the fattest wing in there to see if we reached 165 degrees, all right? So I'll let you know. We'll be back. Look at this. I mean, just listen to it. Oh, almost there. All right, time's almost up. And uh, oh my Lord, I'm really happy with this. Now, because I opened it a couple times, you know, to check it, I'm going to, I might have to add a couple more minutes. It beeps three times when it's done, by the way. All right, so let me go to the thickest wing here. Oh, 170. Oh, yeah. They're cooked. Let me pull this out. Oh. It's 
Got a nice crisp to it there. Yep, it's cooked. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. Let me change the angles and uh, I'll show you what to do. So wait, when you go to Hooters, it's not like a, it's not like they cook it and then they, this is a very thin sauce. Look how beautiful that is. Not as thick as the hot sauce. I like it. I'll take my spoon, okay. Let me get some of this out. They just toss the wings, the fried wings in the sauce. They don't like reheat it with the sauce, okay? Let's just go a little bit faster. Not even using half a jar. It smells delicious too. Whew, one woman show here. Hang on, guys. Okay, so you just put your wings in there. And I didn't flip it over. As you can see, it looks wonderful. Oh yeah. So that's nice, no flipping. Lots of good wings there. So 30 minutes is good, but um, if they're not as thick as these, then just check it like at 20 minutes. But wings in the air fryer, they usually take about, um, let me toss this up and plate it. Wings in the air fryer usually take about 30 minutes as well. So that was good timing on that. So I'm gonna toss this up, plate it, and we'll taste it. Wow. Huh? Oh my gosh. I'm really happy with how this turned out. I like it a lot. So, have a little refreshment. I've loved Hooters uh, wings for <laughs> ever since I discovered it. And I started collecting Hooters items, so I got all kinds of stuff here. <laughs> all right, Whew. here we go. Right? Mm. Okay. All right. Crispy. Yes. Very, very nice. Very crispy. Nice. I had something to do with that Hooters batter, man. Let it stick, sink in overnight. You're good there. It cooked everything evenly on both sides. I didn't have to flip it, like I said. That sauce is delicious. Very spicy, okay? I usually get buffalo garlic, or is it garlic, buffalo? Spicy garlic at Hooters, and uh, this is almost as spicy as that, so it's not for the weak, okay? It's not overwhelmingly hot, it says extra hot. Like, you know, it's, it's not making me cry, but it's, it's, ugh, it's a night. If you like spicy, you would love this. It's a little tangy on the vinegar side. Not too bad, but a little bit. It's got like a, a smoky, something it's very very good i like it so i'm glad i, I found it on um amazon I, I haven't seen it in the store so if you see it let us know in the comments but you definitely need a beverage with it <laughs> all right guys uh so far it's another winner i'm thinking about doing a pizza in there next time you guys want to see that all right thanks for shopping bye, -bye.